So I just made it to my park and it's nearly empty. People on Twitter were telling me to add half a mile to my mile. So here we go. When I first started doing my walks around my park, I could barely do half a mile. Good morning. It's a drizzling, it's cold, and I'm in the park. I just ran for two minutes. For two minutes! I just did two miles and a half, and I um, ran for three minutes. Straight minutes! First time in my life that I run for nine minutes. For August is I want to start training for a 5k. I don't know when I'm gonna do my 5k but when I'm ready but I feel like I can run more than half of my 5k. Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 7. It is Race day. I am pumped, pumped, ready, ready. I'm really pumped. Oh, thank you! <laughs> like my first two. <laughs> I'm so excited. I barely slept last night, which is weird in me, but I guess I'm excited. I'm dying. Okay, let's do this. I'm not late. I'm, I'm it's 7 of 2. You are officially late. I have here on my phone with a timestamp of 701. 701. Late, late, late. So late. <laughs> Hello. Hello. We have made it. They charged us 20 bucks for the parking lot. I didn't know that. Thankfully, we had cash. I'm going to switch to the GoPro now. Bye. The flashlight, the blanket, and the man It's a real adventure, the trail you're looking at I'm glad you came for a while, I thought you might be bailing Is that the same yellow shirt you used to wear? But a thousand years seem like almost no time now This guitar right here, do you still remember how? I played for you, I was crappy, but you sang along and I thought you knew I could die to keep you near We've got a bar in the tent, it's 5.30 a.m. Let's be the kids who left get in trouble again That's stuck got nothing on you Two miles! I have one month to go, I can do this! Do it I don't need to go over old and useless words What you said, what I said, that might have made it worse We're here again at the same spot where we kissed the first time I swear my pain is far away, long gone by now We've got a bottle of tent, it's 5.30 I didn't bring the key with me. Hello, baby. Baby, maratonista. Linda, <laughs> you did it. 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 You no puede ser, no se lo yo cuatro, si no me he ganado nada. Alright, metal and everything. Oh, yeah. Yeah.
you want? What do you want? What do you want? Hey, Jesus. What do you want? Give the lift, 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 give the lift. She's not tired. She is not tired. Woo! I did it! I got it! I can't believe I got this. Oh my god. It's about six hours later from all the clips that you just watched. I can't believe I did it. So last night I went to sleep with a lot of nerves and anxiety and I didn't sleep until about 12. By 12 I finally fell asleep and this morning I woke up at 6. The first thing I did was I went for a banana and a bill bar and that, that was my breakfast. I wanted to have something that I could burn. I ate my banana and my bill bar about 2 hours before the race so I was very glad that I wasn't full but I still had food in me to burn. When we got there, there were a lot of bubbles. By 8.30, we took off. I knew that I wanted to keep the same pace, so I jogged very, very slow at the same pace because I didn't want to wear myself out. From the start, I ran at the same pace. I kept my breathing um, even, and I believe that I jogged for a little under a mile straight or even a mile, I'm not sure, I think it was a little under and then I had to stop and I walked I was, I was, I was resting, I, I walked because I needed to walk so I walked for, I would say a couple of minutes and then I ran again for another stretch and I rested for about a minute or two and then I ran again and so the whole time I was running for long stretches and resting for a couple of minutes sometimes 30 seconds, sometimes 2 minutes it depended, also there were these stations in the middle of the race where you could play with bubbles and get wet and everybody was taking pictures. We stopped at those stations a couple of times to take pictures. I did it in 42 minutes about. I want to say that I did it in 40 minutes, but it was about 42 minutes, which is I think is a really good time for my first time, if I should say so myself. My friends never left me. My best friend, she's really good at running. She would pass us and come back like a shark and go around us and be like, yeah, you guys can. And then my other friend, Daniela, she stayed next to me the whole time, which was really, really nice. The last half mile, I wanted to run the whole thing, but I couldn't. By the last half mile, I was knackered i felt really really tired so i had to slow down i jogged for a little bit i slowed down for a few seconds and i jogged a little more and then i slowed down for 30 seconds and then i run and then i slowed down and i run again and i made it i made, made it to the finish line it was hard it wasn't as hard as i thought it was going to be but it wasn't as easy as some people told me it would be in the middle of it i felt like i was really tired and then um, once I made it past the finish line, I felt like, okay, that's easy, that's fine, I could do this. Seeing the finish line was amazing because I was like, I'm almost done, I'm almost there, and I did it. I couldn't believe the finish line was like in front of me. It was around that time that I was just like, I'm done. Like, I, I think once I got to three miles, I felt like I was done. I was like, I'm tired. I even told my friend, I was like, Daniela, I'm gonna throw up. And she was like, no, you're not. And I was like, you're right, I'm not. And I kept pushing until um, I made it past it. I was so done with the three miles, I didn't even record the finish line. I was just like, I'm done, like I'm done. I'm completely done. A lot of people told me that I was gonna get energy from the 5K and everybody was gonna be encouraging me and that was gonna make it much easier for me. But I didn't feel that way. I felt as tired as if I would have felt at my park. It felt really good to do it. It felt like a good accomplishment. It was hard at times, but I'm, I'm glad I did it. And once I made it past the finish line, I felt like it was so much better. And I was very happy to be at the finish line and got, I got my medal and I went to play with the bubbles. A lot of people told me that once I got to the finish line, I was gonna be like, oh, I could have done it in better time. But the truth is, once I got to the finish line, I felt like I couldn't believe how fast I had run the whole thing. I feel like I did my best and I did better than I thought I did. So for me, the 42 minutes were the best and I'm very proud of those 42 minutes. I would 100% recommend this 5K. The bubble run was so fun and you stop to play with the bubbles and that makes it so much easier. For a first 5K, I think this was the best choice. This or a color run or something fun, something not so serious because it allows you to rest, 
chill and just have fun thanks for watching you don't have to like and subscribe go to the gym drink your water do your squats count your calories don't count your calories do whatever's gonna make you feel your best i support it i'm out peace 2019 is gonna be the year that we're gonna love ourselves physically mentally and emotionally I do not take care of myself as much as I should I don't exercise I don't eat healthy and I don't take my vitamins <laughs> which I'm gonna change I want to start this journey and I want to do it right I hope I don't disappoint it should be fun right